Mike, I give it an extra B&B, you still ain't seeing me. Is that your present? Oh, crap, mom. Do a plastic straw with a fractured jaw. You want to jack it off? That's a fractured claw. Think of it as a dog. You can murk, murk. Burp, burp. Like a skirt, skirt. That's a dirty word. It's not a girl on Earth or any other planet.
I found a rat. Oh, you sleepy, buddy. Ah, some a fluffy puppy dog. Um, uh, um. No, he's not impressed. Aw, come here. Hi, baby. What are you doing? What are you doing? Are you napping? Can I disturb your peace? I'm sorry. You want a treat? <gasps> you want a treat? We can go get you a treat. A treat? All right, let's go. Because them bitches wrote him off, little hussy ass. To get it through your thick skulls that this ain't some bullshit, people don't usually come back this way. And let it be known that from this day forward, but I feel like I'm 6'8. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Mm-hmm. I've got a minute and a half left on my food bowl. I was supposed to be streaming. Well, I mean, not supposed to be. I stream whenever I want. Fucking stream whenever I fucking want to. But I wanted to be streaming like two hours ago when I came home and I fell asleep in this chair sitting like this. And then I woke up. And my left leg was tingly. And my pinkies were tingly from my ha arms hanging off of the armrests. And I was watching. Whose stream did I have on? I don't even remember. I stop when I'm at the very top. You shit it on me on your way up. It's about to be a scary drop. What goes up must come down. Every hour, happy hour now. No, I'm just the cat's meow. Ow. Y'all are doomed. I remember when T-Pain, they want to work with me. My car starts itself, parks itself in auto tunes. T-Pain. How are you going to do with that guy like that? And now I'm fantastic compared to weed high. See me, we fly. Y'all bugging out like Wendy Williams staring at a beehive. And how real is that? Oh, yeah, I had... uh. I think it was Shroud's stream open, but I was watching LSF when I fell asleep. Boom. Did you like your treat? Did you like your treat? Yeah. Did you like your treat? You good boy? Are you good boy? Are you the best dog? Jump! Jump! 
Jump. Jump. Oh, that's a good boy. That's a good boy. Yeah. Come over here. Speak. Oh, that's a good boy. Speak. Speak. Oh, that's a good boy. Come here. Up. Up. Oh, that's a good boy. Oh, that's a good boy. Yeah, you good dog. You good dog. You want some butt scratches? Want some butt scratches? Yeah. Yeah, you want some butt scratches? Oh, You good boy. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You're a good boy. Aw. Are you a lap dog? You're very fluff. Oh, I see a cloud. All right, get down. Good boy. Oh, Luca. Watch, he will consume this too. Hey, Luca. Consume. That's <laughs> <laughs> uh, too funny. Hypnotherapy. Hold up. Be to our Lord Jesus. Good God. I'm not ready to be stuck in a monastery. Hang on. All right, chill out. Silent. No.
Just gotta put this back without anything up. Okay. Now I just gotta push it back. And bring this up. Surely. I've got to figure out something else with this setup, man. Starting with this freaking mic arm. It's half my issue. If I could just find something to hook it to that weighs enough, hold it down. I wonder if I could use like a mic stand. Just have it right here. I don't know. Whatever. I'm not worried about it right now. I'll tell you one thing, brother. This wine would grace the Pope's table. I'm not so sure. It's a bit sour. God knows what's in it. Don't be absurd. It's a first class car, direct from Neumann. No, I know the taste of a good bitch. <laughs> Jonathan's got the car sucks, oh. but. What? Nonsense, it's perfectly drinkable. No, it isn't. It's sour. No matter. We get more to it. All right, where do I get this from? Find out which one of the novices is pious. Do I have to get it tonight? Damn, they like really got me locked in here. Okay, this one's me. Wait to save.
Chambers are supposed to be up. Hold. Oh, I Brother. Up. Yo. Where were you during mass? Don't tell me you didn't know that Holy Mass is the foundation <laughs> on which your life here is built. I was feeling a bit queasy. Really? This time I'll look the other way, but next time you won't get out of being punished. I'd like to ask you... Now what? Can I go outside? No. Greetings, brother. I'm Gregor, and I'm new here. Greetings to you, brother. I'm Yodok, the oldest of the novices. I hope you'll like it here in the monastery and that you won't get into trouble. Trouble? You're young, perhaps intemperate. You might easily stray from the rules of the order. I suggest you get to know the older monks. You never know when it might come in handy. I'm interested in the other novices. Do you know anything about Antonius? Only that he came to the monastery voluntarily, because he didn't want to work in his father's shop. Antonius is alright. You can rely on him. He won't betray a confidence. He's always happy to help, which is more than can be said for the other brothers. I'm interested in Lucas. Nobody knows much about Lucas. He keeps himself to himself. If you ask me, he's got something to hide. I'd keep well clear of him if I was you. Do you have any grounds for suspecting him of something? Quite a lot. And also none at all. The circators who make the rounds despise him, and they never punish anyone without cause. I was talking last night with the brother Circators. It seems you're to fetch them a cask of wine. Like last time. Hey, well... Yes, it's true. I'd like to help you. But, would you really do it? To get hold of the wine, we'll have to leave the monastery for a bit. I, I know it's forbidden, but we've no other option. If wine started going missing here, someone would notice. But to leave the monastery, we need the keys. And only the prior has those. Oh, great. Wait a moment. Are you saying I'm supposed to steal the prior's keys so I can go and steal wine somewhere else? Well, you see why I don't want to do it myself now, do you? I don't have what it takes. I, I can't get those keys, but you could. Or, or you might be able to pick the locks. But you've done it once before, haven't you? Last time, the prior was sick. And he left the monastery keys in the circator's care. So they unlocked the gates for me. This time we'll have to steal the keys. How can I get hold of the keys, do you think? I, I just don't a whole know. But it might be possible to do this without people them. Just watching you have this Brother Solarius, the cellar keeper, used to be a burglar. He knows his way around locks, and, and maybe could help us. If you could find a way to arrange it. Do you think he'll want to take part in theft? No, but you could give some advice, or maybe get some lockpicks to open the gate. You'll figure something out. If you think so, I can try. Once you have the key or some lockpicks, come and see me and we'll make our plan. About those keys. Did you get them? No. Keys? Oh, at least lockpicks. Not yet. Well, hurry up then. 
You don't want to keep the brothers waiting. Visit the cellar keeper. He can help you. Can you tell me something about yourself? I would if there was anything noteworthy to say. But I'm just the ordinary so Why did you join the monastery? Because it was better than living in poverty. As the youngest son, I'm not entitled to inherit. And you know what? I'm glad to be here. Who would you vote for as the new abbot if you could? Why do you care? We don't have the right to vote, so we shouldn't get mixed up in it. I'm just interested, that's all. I like John better. But like I've said, it's not our place to get involved. It's enough that Antonius is mixed up in it. Don't you start too. I'd like to ask you something about... Who's in charge of things? Truthfully, everyone except us. But a fish... Are there already cat Brothers John and Nevlas. But the others have been fighting like dogs because of them. We don't have to fight about anything, though. <clears throat> Why can't novices vote? I want to vote. They say we don't have enough experience to decide about anything. Don't worry. We'll get our chance. Why is who wins so important? We're young and we'll spend the rest of our lives here. And the abbot decides everything about our lives. Didn't it ever occur to you how powerful he is? Well, that's all. Thank you for your time, brother. All right. Something there with a C. I was mute and was humble and kept silence even from good. Here the prophet shows that if the spirit of silence sought to be as in times to refrain from public speech, so much the more of the punishment of sin make us avoid evil words. Therefore, since the spirit of silence is so important, permission to speak should rarely be granted even to perfect disciples, even though it be for good, Excuse you. holy, edifying, sacred. Or Can I sit down? In much speaking, we will not escape sin. Yeah. You. What do you desire, Brother Gregory? I'm looking for some. And what would that be? I'm looking for lock picks. Lock picks? What's it to you? Do you have some or not? Peace, brother. There's no need to get all worked up. <laughs> so you heard I used to be a burglar, did you? Yes. I put it all behind me as soon as I took the vows. But I do have a few lock picks left. I'll trade them for food. Get me a bite to eat, and you can have your lock picks. Holy... I have so much food. Better than that, can I? Seventeen onions, Jesus. This isn't even going to buy me one lockpick. Surely. And again, let's have a word about the price. Your son with the rod, hmm. and you will deliver All right, so death. the rule of Saint Benedict readings on daily manual labor. 
Idleness is the enemy of the soul. Are we agreed? The should be occupied at you won't convince me with that. Labor, and again at fixed hours and He's pissed. To that end, I don't have any. The times for each may be prescribed any money? Follows. From Easter until what would you like? October. When they come out from prime in the morning, let them labor at whatever is necessary until about the fourth hour. And from the fourth hour until about the sixth, let them apply themselves to read. He only has ten. How much does he sell? Their weakness Praise be to Christ, be brother. Into consideration by the abbot. The rule of Saint Benedict. I'm looking for some and what? Silence. Let us do what the prophet says. I'm looking I for luck. Pick. My ways, that I may not sin with my tongue. I'd like. Well, say. I'll treat. Dude. I have all the foods. But it's not enough. What do you desire, Brother Gregor? But as for course, Jesus, Brother, I see. Words, so it's... Well, yes. Be hmm. That won't be easy, I can tell you that straight off. And for such the prior always keeps the keys close by him. So how exactly do you imagine I could the help? Of Saint Benedict, readings on humility. The first degree of humility is obedience without delay. God be with you. This is the How can I get hold of them? Nothing dearer to them with than great Christ. difficulty. Who, because of the Holy Unless Spirit, you want to rob the prayer. Fear of hell and the glory of life everlasting. As soon as anything has been ordered, Is there any other way to get out of here? As a the door out of the monastery is like any other. Only the locks more complicated than most. But I can sell you some lock picks. And with a little training, you'll make short work of it. Could you take the... Rob the prior? You wouldn't be doing it for... Then what could you possibly pay me? I'm done with my thieving, and you'd have to offer me a whole lot of groschen to change my mind. How much would you want? A princely sum, brother. This is no trifling matter. That much? Where am I supposed to find that much coin? No one here has any money. Precisely. You already want no that much for the damn lock no picks. And think twice before you ask me that kind of favor again. The rule of Saint Benedict. Readings on humility. The first degree of humility is obedience without delay. This is the virtue of those who hold nothing dearer <coughs> than Christ. Who, because of the holy service, okay. they have professed. And the fear of God and the glory of life. Dude. This guy sucks. Delay, lukewarmness, grumbling or objection. For the obedience given to superiors is given to God. For if the disciple obeys with an ill will and murmurs, not necessarily with his lips, but simply in his heart, then even though he fulfills the command of the Wow. 
already robbed this place. and cannot suffer any delay in executing it. But this very obedience will be acceptable to God and pleasing to men only if what is commanded is done without hesitation. All the books. So many books. I feel goofy, did you bonk your head? You alright, Cloud? Alright, now what? boot oh that poop falls a long way Abominable 
It's preposterous. The young people have no respect for writing these days. But they'll learn. We were no Where's the alchemy bench? I'm Gregor, a novice. <clears throat> I know. I saw you at the ceremony. My name is Neblis, and I'm the provost here. I'm in charge of the monastery's property, as well as handling trade with the outside world. That means you get to leave the monastery? No, not at all. I just write lists and send them out. Oh. Tell me about yourself. I'm the provost of this monastery, but in reality... I'm interested in the... You're not alone. Why? What's wrong with it? Many brothers... What sins are you talking? The scripture says that he... I'm sorry, Greg. Tell me some... When he... Can you tell me... Pick... With, you. with what? I'm interested in... You can count on my help. In order to get the recipe for this medicant... I, however, the cure for a Why are they... Even si Where can I... In no. Is... I'm ready. One more. They say Brother Solarius understands locks. But don't tell him why you need it. Once you have the book, bring it to me. We'll soon have the election of the abbot over and done with. Okay. I'm here to work. Excellent. I've been waiting for you. There's the alchemist's laboratory. You'll find ingredient. Today it's your task to concoct two potions to aid digestion. Once you finish them, you'll find me somewhere nearby. Don't forget to... Okay. Digestion. Getting beat up by the cat. Luca, you okay? Great digestive potion. Two chamomile. In a mint. You'll need spirits and a handful of mint and two chamomile. Grind the chamomile. Drop everything into the cauldron and boil for one turn. Okay, so grind two chamomile. Mortar. Oh, wait, first. Inventory. Chamomile. <laughs> Mint.
Oh, that's cool. Okay, but spirits. Yes, yes, okay. Should be one. Sick. One nettle and two belladonna. Okay, so... Boil nettle for two turns. Wait, how many nettle? Just one. Oops. Oh. Poison? Oh no. What is it, brother? I've finished my work. Show me what you've made. Spectacular, Gregor. You've found your talent. Soon enough, you'll be <coughs> teaching the other novice. I am Gregor. Brother, what are you doing here? Shouldn't you be working somewhere? Idle hands are the...
I had other affairs that needed to be attended to immediately. It will never happen again. Really? What do you desire, Brother Gregor? About you and... Ask me anything you want. I'm not... Re then why are you waste? Thank you for answering. Mm. I'd like to ask... I'd like to ask you, what can you tell me about... Then what can I say? I meant something specific. But you know, Antonius... My name's Gregor, a novice. You can call me Siskin. Now, are you here of your own free will, or is this a punishment? Although, it's not important. Welcome to purgatory. Did you say purgatory? purgatory? You'll see soon enough. Soon enough. This guy's not impressed. Will you tell me something? Look, nothing... Are you hiding something? Why are you so reluctant to tell me anything about yourself? I'm hiding a lousy past that I'd rather forget. I hate to think of all I lost when they stuck me in here. And also because I really hate the question, aren't you the son of the famed Sir Smil Flashka of Pardubitz? I was rich and I had huh? everything. But then my father began to feel his time approaching, so he decided to... I've no head for man. This is him, isn't it? I can feel it in my joints. The new leaves then. My joints started aching just before they really swelled. And now they hurt again. The worse than last time. I tell you, something is going to happen out there. What's your plan with it? To get out of here as God is the architect of But you didn't They must have written <laughs> and you stuck indeed. That's all I want. Please keep. I'm still curious. It's no big, terrible. S what kind of a book is it? I found it here in the library. It was on a shelf where it. Sh it's the Necronomicon. God, who knows what it means? <laughs> oh. Bah. If it wasn't harmful, that's a rather limited view. Just please. I'll leave you be. Don't worry, I won't follow you again. Thank you, and please. How is it that I've? I've been. Tell me. Speed run, what? speed run the dialogue. I don't care. I don't care. There's so much talking in this Not monastery. So. I'm over it. Someone really looked at matters. You're right. It starts with a wine dialogue, and it's not in the first half. If possible, one will be soon solved. It's a wonder the prior doesn't kick everyone look in the morning. Then he'd see a right. man. Okay, what does my log say now?
Ah, oh, Gregor. I'll be interested to... That's all. I'm no priest, but tell me what you've done. It's... I'm here in the monastery looking for a thief. He had a hand in burning down the Neuhof stud. You don't say. And who are you to take such a... That's not important. Why are you telling me this anyway? Perhaps you could help me find him? The missing thief? If I knew anything, I'd tell I know. Three? Please, leave me out of it. And you're right that it could be any one of them. No one knows anything about Lucas. Siskin might be a lot of things, but a monk isn't one of them. And Yodok is a slimy worm. It wouldn't surprise me if he was behind that massacre. Actually, the more I think about it, the less I like that Yodok. He's a treacherous rat who'd do anything to get in someone's good books. The thought of Yodok at Neuhof since chills up my spine. <sighs> Maybe you're right. It's not a pretty thought. Hmm. Thanks for your help. And please don't say a word to anyone. Don't fret, my friend. Your secrets are locked inside my lips. What? Mm. Okay. Um I need to get a lockpick. Get me out of here. Someone's been creeping around in the corridor at night. What am I saying? Creeping. He was stomping about like a bear. That must have been Brother Cicada. He can't sleep and prays long into the night. Yeah, it was definitely me. Um. Well, first of all, gotta find Brother John. Where'd this man go? Yo. Praise be to Christ, brother. Nevelis wanted me to steal a forbidden book from the library. Really? Oh, this must be a dream. Actually. This would never have occurred to me, even in my wildest dreams. Which book? Uh, what did he want it for? What was that writer called? Avi... Avi... Ah, Avicenna. A pagan and a Mohammedan. He wanted to use it to help heal Abbot Peter. What? That dirty <laughs> louse thinks he can steal magic what? books and use them to curse good Christians? Well, he shan't, as long as my name's John. I don't think it's really like that. It was a medicinal book, and Nevelis had good intentions. Brother, if the book is forbidden, there is a good reason for it. Forbidden books are full of magic, blasphemy, and witchcraft. There's no excuse for reading them, let alone stealing them from where they've been safely hidden away. Nevelis has committed a grave offence, and he'll pay for it. But listen, brother, for the time being, keep it to yourself. Now, you've helped me greatly, but I'll save it for when Nevelis begins elbow. The power of truth is greatest. As you wish. I won't. F I need to tell you. Well, well. You wanted me to steal a for. I just ah. told him that. Some sort of witchcraft. He said he wanted to cast spells and summon <laughs> demons. You're exaggerating. That no one would believe that. But if he could. Thank you. Your honesty and power. Direct. I'm moving now. Am 
Well, I'm neglecting anything. Shit. Brother? What? What are you doing here? Shouldn't you be working somewhere? Idle hands. I definitely was there. I did come a little late, so... Really? Oh, this guy hates me now. What? Like a bear. No. That must have been for the cicada. It was me. Why are all you guys picking flowers? Where's the one that sells lockpicks? chickens Do 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 do. <clears throat> very very sneaky. What is it, brother? <sighs> There's something I should tell you. Something you won't be happy to hear. I'm here to find someone and, um, well, to do away with him. But listen, it's not murder. Not when it's a man it's like not him. not murder. He's one of the people who burned down Neuhoff. He doesn't deserve to live. What's he doing here? And who are you? They call him pious because he used to be a priest. When he found out a lot of people were after him, he hid away here. And as you can see, escaped suspicion. They sent me here to find him and bring him to justice. He's one of the novices. So we have one outlaw and one assassin in our midst. This place is a lot more exciting than I expected. Do you know who it is? Well, that's just it.
could be Antonius. Antonius? He's a fine fellow. No, no, it can't be him. Although, you never know Unless. what's hiding beneath the man's skin. See how hard it is? It could be anyone, and at the same time, nobody in particular. No, but I hope I'll track him down soon. If you find any clue that could lead me to him... I swear I don't know anything. Ex I suspect it could be Yodok. Do you know that occurred to me too? Yodok's a scout. I suspect Lucas. He certainly says little enough, and he keeps himself to himself. I could well believe he's hide. It could be you. <laughs> what on earth makes you think that? True enough. I won't tell you. You're talking about killing and... Would you do that? I have a feeling you wouldn't. You're right. Thank you, Siskin. Where's the freaking monk that sells the damn... Surely he's up here. Get away from our cabinet. The book stood in there after you all. Praise be to our Lord Jesus. Where did this guy go? Isn't he supposed to like guard something in this building? Can't find him anywhere. Surely he's out here somewhere. Stibor, no. 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 Well. Shit. Brother? What? What are you doing here? Oh my god. Come now, brother. Oh, would you really punish a friend for what? Fine then. This time I will forgive you. Fuck. In the workshop for how long? Oh, shit.
Can I steal foods? Oh my god, the key? Oh shit. Oh, I got that key. It's too easy. No. Brother. What? What are you doing? You're right, brother. This is your first. I've been on my way there now. I gotta go to the workshop. What? What do I gotta what do now? What do you desire, brother Gregor? Your mom? I'm here to work. Good. This is my. Here's the original. Oh, God. I can't wait. I love transcribing. What a phenomenal life experience. Giving me a cutscene for this. I did it. Perfect. Oh, this is quite an excusable boy. Can you even read? Uh, yeah, I can, but like... It's just kind of tough. A 
monk's got no business out here. What are you doing? What happened to your vow? You're playing truant from the monastery, aren't you? No? What the? I'm not a monk, I'm naked. I just want to rejoin civilization. I hate it in there. Can I access my horse's stuff? Oh my god. <clears throat> to the door. Who's gonna know somebody got out? book in this building oh, here's a page oh shit I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm sorry see I was running around outside and people were yelling at me I don't know how long each job is, so I'm just kind of stuck here. It's cringe. I have my wine for the people downstairs. I have my dagger. I just need to kill this man. I'm in trouble. Okay. Go one more hour. I've got to get out of here. This humming of chanting and of freaking prayer in the background is... Driving me to the brink of insanity. Oh, shit. Uh... I guess I just fast forward at night time. Loompa loompa doompa dee do. Can 
Come on. Oh, shoot. For it is written, in much speaking, you will not escape sin. I missed prayer and mass again. They're going to freaking murder me. Go to bed. Oh, great. I missed mass again. Oh my gosh, I can unlock this. I didn't know that led to outside. I need to go downstairs. Yo. Peace be with you, brother. Brother. Where were you during mass? Oh, Don't tell me you didn't know that holy mass is the foundation on which your life here is built. You're right, brother. This is your second warning. Do it again and you will be punished. What would you like? Dude, I got your wine. Ah, uh, Grigor, talk to me. I'd like to ask... Does it even matter? Do I still have the quest? Like, why? Uh, hello? Why can't I turn this in? Uh, hmm. You and your novices, you old pervert. A toast to our future oh, abbot. Say. I'll drink to that. So, to John, the future abbot, and a pox on Nevis. That kills you, I? He'd love to have us all under his thumb. Fat chance. Don't worry. Those youngsters will wise up once they hear all about him. Will they believe it? Even if just two or three of them do, it'll help us. So, to Abbot John. To Abbot John. What would you like? Okay, well. To Abbot John. I still don't have a lockpick. Did I sell my dagger? Let's go. Oh, shoot, it's the same door. Find where the dorms are. I always lose where it's at. Not right there. Isn't there a door in there? Oh, wait. It was. Oh my god, I'm dumb. It was where I was before. Yes. Just up here.
get this guy out of here. Surely there's no patrol in the hallway. Okay. I gotta make it all the way out there with this body. <laughs> what the f What the frick? Very, very sneaky. What the hell is all this? Wait, that leads into the monastery. for a second. Okay. And through the fire and flames we carry on. How much time do I have until he comes back? Oh, 
Oh shit, that's a different guard. Oh you fuck. Stop right where you Nope. Surrender. You'll have to <laughs> Go, go, go. Nope. Hey, you! Halt! Nope. You there! Stop! Nope. Hey, you! Nope. Don't, move Don't touch me. Hey, you! What? Halt! Nope. Don't move a finger. Shut up. Never find me. <clears throat> How am I supposed to get that guy out of here? Oh, it's to my left. Oh, man. Unless I can get out through that building, but I don't want to get out that way. I might as well just go through the bridge, right? I mean...
I don't know if I'm supposed to take this. I made it. <laughs> How do I get across this water? You're kidding me. Dude, I'm just, you know what? I don't know what just happened. What? Surrender. Yo, I did. Committed a violation. You're no. under arrest. Are you? What violation? I was told you were dragging a lifeless body around on your shoulder. Where the fuck do you think you are? Personally, I'd rather string you up, but unfortunately. Look, I'll tell you the truth. <laughs> but that won't. Goodbye. Excuse me, boys.
must flee. You know what? I'll come back for you, horsey. They're not mad at you. This is so scuffed. This is not how I wanted this to end. Gotta get across this stupid river. Eat all the cheese. I've got to get rid of some of this. Oh my gosh, I have so much stuff.
Cabbage. Be twenty pounds still. Jesus. It's all my cheese and bread. Just shit off my off my inventory. What? The sound food makes when you go over <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I know what you mean. Alright, geez, man. I just went through that was so scuffed. That was so scuffed. I was not supposed to do that mission like that. I don't even know what's about to happen. But I'm free from the monastery and I don't have to listen to church hymns anymore, so I'm happier. Can I get through? Ah! I can't see anything. Swamp is like a maze. This looks like the place they were talking about. Mm -hmm. Okay, boss champ. Coke Zero is empty. Oh, progress. Morning, sunshine. Hope we didn't wake you. Kurva. Did you have to sneak up on me like thieves? We are thieves. Besides, we had to make sure you weren't followed. Or trying to lead us into a trap. But enough of this chit chat. Okay, go Let's get candy down candy. to business. We heard there was some trouble at the monastery. Question is, was it the right sort? Did you do that job we agreed? Yeah, I just kind of fucked it up. Do you think I'd be sitting here if I didn't do it? How should I know? The world's full of idiots. It's done. You've got proof? He had this on him. Hmm. Aye. That says alright. What did you do with the body? I dragged it away and buried it. That must have been quite a job. <laughs> I didn't bury it, I threw it in the river. True, it wasn't easy. But if I'd left the corpse, they'd know for sure I was the killer. This way, they just lost a couple of novices. Or do you think it would have been better to leave the body there? No, I just have to make sure you did what was needed. Not even a mouse can get into that damn monastery, so I've no choice but to trust you. And do you trust me? Yeah. Okay. What now? What now? You did your job. Welcome. 
We need people like you. But what do you need people like me to do? <laughs> I'm just a crimp. All I do is recruit. Now you get to go to our camp and find out everything you need to know. Where? Are you seriously telling me you didn't notice the camp? Not too observant, are you? Well, there's a hill above Sassau, and on top, there's an old abandoned fort. Only it's not as abandoned as it used to be. That's where the camp is. Okay. Go there and report to a fellow by the name of Eric. Tell him Kozliak sent you. And they'll let me in just like that? Good point. I almost forgot. At the gate, show them the special die you took off Pius. That's our sign. That's all? That's all. You'll learn everything you need to know at Vranik. And hurry up. I've got a feeling there's something being planned. Hmm. Okay. First... First I go to Privis Levitz. I've got to have a pretty penny saved up from this town now. <clears throat> I've been stuck in a monastery for days. Usually get stopped like three times here. There was one. Oh, there's two. Oh, it's only two. it. Oh. That's kind of depressing. Um. Hmm. Don't I have a trader now, too? Your How much money do you have? <clears throat> 500. I have 19 bread rolls. Oh my god. Dandelion, good lord.
going on. Time to go to this thing. Oh yeah, I gotta. Oh, I have the judge. <coughs> what do you people want? What is it this time? We needed a butcher, and now two have come at once. But we only have a place for one. So we should take mm. the best one. No? That's just the thing. It's six of one and half a dozen of the other. Ratai would have neither of them. But we can't be so selective. What's wrong with them? Surely they can't both be completely useless. No, but from what people say, the first one, Cockfirst, isn't an honest trader. He cheats ordinary folk. But he's the very soul of fairness when dealing with the wealthy What's the the and the law keepers. So he's never been officially accused of anything untoward. The other butcher, Brisky, always had a reputation as an honest trader and a good Christian. But then he defiled his profession when he butchered a cow that had died of natural causes and gave the meat to the needy. Ah, so he's a pariah like the knacker, and no respectable person should buy meat from him? Just so. So there you have it. One tarnished, the other dishonest. Hmm. I might have known it wouldn't be easy. We'll take Cockwurst. Well, much as I sympathize with Brisket, under the circumstances, I have to go with Cockwurst. He'll cheat <laughs> and folk will complain, cockwurst. but better that than a butcher no one wants to buy from. I trust you've made the right decision. <laughs> I'll inform him right away. Ugh. <laughs> <clears throat> <clears throat> oh. The way they pronounce that W just gets me. <laughs> oh, as much as I sympathize with the one, I'll have to go with Cook first. <laughs> Whew, that's too good. Oh. <laughs> uh. That was the easiest judging I've done in this town so far. All right. Why does the town that I live in have to live or have to be halfway across the freaking world? I fast travel so far. Oh, well, I only got stopped once up there, so that's good. Oh, and once there. The forest, man. That's where they get you. Well, 
Let's also do some travel music. Fly majestically through the sky, but I can walk. They can walk. Other Pokemon can dig a hole that's real deep and big, but I can walk. They can walk. I don't quite know where I am going, but still, if there's anywhere that can be walked to, I will my but I don't need a reason to keep walking, I just do One time back home with you Other Pokemon can shout And two blazers from their mouth But I can walk They can walk <laughs> They can walk funny because there's a couple times where you had it on at work and i was like i play that song every time i <laughs> i can walk they can walk i'm like there's no way he's listening to this right now let's just be on his ipad <laughs> i thought he's gonna be stuck in his head at work all day what I got super tired. I got to drink that. It's going to make me wasted in like 30 minutes, though. <sighs> Captain Bernard. I'll be with you. Where's Radzig? Oh. Sir, I have news, and I'm sorry to say it's nothing good. After everything that's happened, you have even worse news. That's almost impressive. <laughs> I'm afraid so. It's going to happen again, and on an even bigger scale. You're full of good cheer, aren't you? What exactly will happen? It seems the Pribislavitz encampment was just the start, and they're far from defeated. How did you find out? I found a recruiting agent who worked for them, and let him recruit me. Ah, God's holy hat! You never cease to surprise me, lad. And what did you find out? They have another much bigger encampment in Vranik, near to Sasau. What do those bastards want? And who the hell are they? To hurt us? Conquer the region? I'm not sure yet, but I can find out. How? I'm one of them now. I have their secret sign. I know where their camp is. All I have to do is go and take a look. That's out of the question. It's too risky. Sire, compared to everything I went through to get this, it will be child's play. I already passed their test. They trust me. <laughs> then we'll have to attack them before <laughs> things Don't get tell out them of I back. had to do a murder. Ideally, right now, when they're not expecting us. Once we catch that mangy little shit, we can ask him nicely what he wants. But then again, before we attack... It would be useful to have a spy go and scout out how many of them there are and what they're up to. I don't want you to take any unnecessary risks. It's much less risky than our raid on Pribislavitz. All right then, Hal. Go there and find out how many of them there are and what their plans are, whatever you can. But don't stick your neck out too far. Yes, sir. Godspeed, lad. Welcome, Henry. You. Is there a place I can sleep in here? Let me just shut that. Nobody. I'm not creeping around like a footpad. Nobody knows that I'm sleeping in this bed. Don't wake me up. I need to rest. I need my beauty sleep. And this bed is a hundred percent comfort. Your energy fills up so much faster. I mean, so like thirty percent. You got to sleep for twelve hours to get like sixty energy.
I can walk. I don't really know where I am going just then. If there's any place that can be walked to, I will. Alright. What are you looking at? Main level? Ooh. Okay, what do we got here? Last 30% longer without food, but as soon as you get hungry, the effects will be 20% worse. When dirty, you'll have 50% more charisma when talking to women. However, people smell you a mile off, reducing your stealth skill. Your stamina will regenerate 20% faster at night and 10% slower during the day. You grow up in impoverished conditions, so comfort of beds is inverted for you. The worse the bed, the better you sleep. Penalties on stats following release from jail are 20% lower. In towns and villages and their immediate vicinity, you have a one bonus to strength, agility. Oh. What is it? In the wilds, okay. Brute, your favor, your strength, no. Local hero. Herbalism. You've got enough fragrant herbs in your inventory. You get a two charisma bonus. If your horse has enough fragrant herbs in its saddlebag, it will shy less. Okay. Oh, two reading herbs. All books are cheaper in shops. First time you look at a fresco across a way shrine, your charisma, okay. Your level of study, wait, your level of study of the book you've read most of what? Oh, most of will advance automatically while sleeping or skipping time. Doesn't matter to you where you read, you get a learning bonus anywhere you read. We'll just take the, take the guard perk. Oh, there was another one, wasn't there? There was. I'll do the, uh, Get double the reading. Um, map. Alright, I guess I just ride out. Yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah. Yeah. Surely. Yeah. Won't take any damage going down here. Yeah. The 
this is so scuffed. On second thought, I go here. Yeah. Oh, I'm stuck on a stick. Oh my gosh. Yeah. All right, here we go. Yeah. Country roads. Take me home. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. gonna be riding for a minute. <laughs> she yelled, no! And the guy said, I'll slay you. Masaka, I'm gone. I'm so fast, I can't see myself. Did I just... That was interesting. I just ghost yeah. rode the horse and he jumped. But I gotta be close now. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my gosh, this is a huge hill. They weren't kidding. Here and nobody knows. Oh, I just got defeated by a tree stump. Well, it's better to on foot it from here anyway. This place is massive. Warning. Oh. This is here. Holy crap. What do you want? Come on. Let me inside. Inside, eh? What's the password then? I came here for a game. Show me that. Hi. All right. Welcome to Vrani, comrade. Thank you for your kind welcome, comrade. Who should I report to? Eric. He should be in the house, at the top. That was easy. Now I'd better take a look around here. Oh, great.
Okay. We got bandits. Fist fight the whole camp because I opened that chest? Yo! I mean, if we're not drawing any weapons. Oh. Okay, okay, okay! What am I getting hazed? Take me alive. You call that combat. Yeah. Freaking go to sleep. Apologize for the discomfort, but it's for your own safety and ours, of course. You can count yourself lucky, lad. I'm going to keep you alive. I'm sure your father will pay a nice fat ransom for you. Huh? My father's dead. That lucky of yours wouldn't even let me bury him. He doesn't know, Eric. Nobody told him. They told me, a foreigner, but not him. Oh, no. Did put up a good I'm fight. sure you'd I'm rather hear it out. under different circumstances and from someone else, boy. But beggars can't be choosers. Your father, your real father, is alive. You even know him. It's your liege lord, Radzik Kobela. Although, how much can he really care about you? Here you are, a homeless orphan. And he still hasn't acknowledged you. Your parents are both dead, aren't they? I thought so. And yet, Radzig still hasn't told you the truth. Could it be that he's ashamed of you? Hmm. I wonder if you'll want to pay that ransom after all. Well, best not think about that. If your father won't pay your ransom, you have no value to me. My father's dead. I understand why you feel that way. My own childhood was not dissimilar. How strange that we should have something in common. But I've delayed long enough. Now it's time for you to tell me why you came here. I was looking for my father's sword. Why? What the? What, hello? Stolen by a certain bastard. <laughs> oh. And I found. But I wonder which father you mean. Hey, that's mine. In a way, it belongs to both. Doesn't matter who it belongs to. I'm gonna kill you with it. Ooh. You're hardly in a position to threaten me. But now I think of it, why not? 
When your father, your real father, pays, I'll give you an opportunity to try. I think that's very generous of you. Isn't it? <laughs> Radzik will crush you, and I'll be there to see it. I very much doubt it. You spied at our camp. You must realize that your father hasn't a fraction of the forces I've gathered. And now, with the king in captivity, there's no one to levy troops to come to your aid. Don't Even you. united with Hanush and Divish, your father couldn't raise more men than I have. The only force in this country capable of defeating me is Sigismund's. And he pays me. When he wins, I win. Everything I take now will be mine. And I plan to take everything. So meet the new lord of the realm. A man like you will never rule here. Don't have you, you never heard of Lord Sockle of Lamberg? Or Sahinek, the dry devil? They fought for your king and plundered the estates of the lords in Austria, just as I'm doing here. Like they say, the stronger dog fucks the bitches. And war is a nasty business. Is that what they say? Sir? I haven't heard that Fine. one. <laughs> now, I'm afraid I have more important business to attend to. I'll leave Udo here to keep you company. And let's hope for both <laughs> our sakes that your father pays up. Farewell. Rotten hell! <laughs> Knock some manners into him, Udo. Come on, Eric, let's go. We've got work to do. <laughs> I can't stop thinking of a... Henry. Pineapple Express where he's like, I'm gonna flex and bust out of here. Jesus, that brute really works. You over. Who are you? Here. Try to drink. I thought you'd never come round. How do you know my name? Don't you recognize me? It's Bishek. Oh. You fucking traitor. You throw me to those bastards, and then look me in the eye like nothing shh, happened. Shh, be quiet. Maybe we started off on the wrong foot. But I'm your only chance to get out of here alive. So do you want my help or not? No. What do you want? I want to get you out of here. But if you'd rather, I can leave you to rot and get the shit kicked out of you by Istvan's bruiser. Was I actually supposed to go and report to that guy when I walked in the camp and I just like took the scuffed route because I started looking around? <sighs> Why would I have shouldn't I? I so I don't like this guy. But I do care. I don't believe a word you say. I know you're up to something. So you better try harder to convince me, or I'm not going anywhere with you. Not a day passes without these cutthroats pulling daggers on each other. And I'm the youngest, so they make a slave out of me. <laughs> a bandit's life isn't quite how you imagined it, eh? My heart bleeds. But you could easily make a run for it on your own. Why bother with me? Look, I just want to live a normal life. For that, I need peace and some coin. You need to get out of here, and you've got coin. My help won't cost you a tenth of what Istvan would want from Sir Ratzik. Why shouldn't we help each other? Okay, fair enough. All right, then. Let's get out of here. Untie me. That's what I want to hear. But first, swear you'll tell Sir Ratzik I helped you. And that you'll pay me, too. You have my word. What's the plan? All right, I'll have to trust your man of honor. Now listen, I found a place where you can easily get out. Down in the camp on the slope above Sasal, there's a place where they throw the waste over the wall. The pile of shit reaches almost to the top of the stockade. All we have to do is jump over and we'll have a soft landing. Then we're free. Free and covered in shit. So that's all? Well, first, we both have to get there. We can't let anyone see either of us. 
I'm supposed to be guarding you, and you're... Well, I'm supposed to be guarding you. So we have to keep to the shadows, and stay away from prying eyes. I'll go first. I need my stuff. There shouldn't be anyone outside. I'll wait for you, not far from the camp, by the dead tree between... Where's my stuff? I want my loot first. What? <clears throat> I'm captured. Surely. Not a very sneaky person. Is my stuff in there? Vanished. Must be here somewhere. Wrong door. Come on, man. I'm in my cage. I'm about to beat him up. I'm not beating him up. stuff Now what what part of the The poop end is all the way over there Oh no How many saviors not so my last one. Of course it is. Oh my gosh, there's two right there.
two hearts. And a third one on the other side of that gate. Is that the only way out? Oh no, I gotta get to the other side. Very, very sneaky. Okay, this is not working. I've got to get to the other side of that fence. <laughs> trapped in here. Can't make it out of there. Got an idea. It's a really bad idea, but it's an idea. It goes like this. I'm a freaking ninja.
God, there's a guy right there. Please, I'm stuck. Hmm, the wall here isn't too high. I made it. I'm free. Oh, I broke my foot. I can't see shit. There we go. Ouchie. Ouchie. Yo. So, we're out. Now it's time for you to keep your part of the bargain. <laughs> Don't worry, I keep my word. But I have to go to Ratai and see my... my father. They took my coin when they captured me. Fine. We should get out of here as quick as they we took can. My anyway. coin? Well, you'll have to help me. Somehow the massage I, like I got from that big I bastard like didn't do me a lot of good. I don't suppose you have a horse hidden around here. A horse? <laughs> Actually, I didn't think of that. I have a horse. Oh, I'm still all messed up. What do you mean? I can't just whistle and a horse freaking appears out of thin air? God, that would suck. Especially traveling with this idiot. Any word about your boy, Radzig? Nothing yet. Well, let's hope he hasn't done anything rash. Wouldn't surprise me, given the balls that he has. Now, I wonder where he might have got those from. Don't start, Hanush. I'm sorry, sir. This fellow... Henry. Father? <laughs> I told you he had balls. Well, I see that you haven't been idle, and we'll certainly need to have a talk later, but not quite so publicly. Looks like you have plenty to tell us. What happened? I, uh... I got a bit tied up at Vranjik. But now I know what they're planning. A bit tied up, oh. You know, quite literally. Let's see what, what you did there. Planned? And who's planning it? Spit it out, boy! There's no longer any doubt about it. 
It's that Hungarian noble you were hosting on the same day Sigismund pillaged Skalitz. Sir Istvan Toth. Toth and his people. Everything fits. They're the ones making the counterfeit money and using it to hire mercenaries from all around. He's already got quite an army at Vranjik. But what the fuck is he after? I can tell you exactly, and you won't like it. How's that? I had quite a long talk with him. What? When I was trying to get into his camp, I was taken captive. We had a bit of a chat. Actually, he told me his entire plan. What? I suppose he thought he didn't need to keep it secret any longer. I'm not all that surprised. Why not? What's that bastard planning? He's in the service of Sigismund. He wants to destroy King Wenceslas' allies. That means us. He's gathered a very large force. I'm honestly not sure if we can defeat them. And he knows no one will come to our aid now. That fucking cunt! I'll skin him alive! How many men has he got? More than a hundred, I'd say. And how secure is their camp? It's an old abandoned fortress on a hill above Sassau. It's inaccessible from three sides, surrounded by a timber palisade. Bastard! I'll crush that rebel of his! You should That's show what up. say, old friend. It seems Toth isn't taking any chances. Together with Divish, we can muster enough men. And we can all see there's no time to waste. That bastard wants a battle? Much better we pick a time and place than he does. Undoubtedly. We have to take them by surprise. It would be best to attack tomorrow night. We can't get ready any sooner. <laughs> That's what I like to hear, Radzig. Henry, I want you to get yourself fixed up and then go straight to Sir Divish of Talmberg. Tell him to assemble all the able-bodied men he can and bring them to Vranik tomorrow evening. We'll wait for him there. Yes, sir. Finally, a chance to show I'm not carrying a sword just for ornament. What is it, Henry? Is there something else? The thing is, we have to deal with Zbyshek. I see. And who is he? <sighs> do I kill him? Or do I set him free? I'm gonna see if I can find something really quick. I can't remember what he did at the beginning of the game. This is not what I wanted to see. Okay, maybe if we do like kingdom <coughs> come deliverance first hour. You know what? Where's you know maybe I just you know Look at my own video. Oh. That's the camera. 
Okay. Okay, and close. Oh, shoot. What have I done? Where's this at? Just like the flock of ravens that has descended on this land to peck up every speck of gold and silver. Oh. I didn't... Damn. I didn't stream the beginning of this game. That's cringe. Uh, kingdom come deliverance. Give me like, like, play through. Here we go. <clears throat> oh, it's yellow. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Who did the slaughtering spoke a, a strange so let's save her we can save her like this just hit and run or we can do this another way so i'm gonna reload so see you back at this point This is tutorial about horse riding. You can pause and read this if you want. So the other way to save this lady is just whistle. Does it go back? This is him going back, okay. I think. Oh, it's like right here. I have to see this before I just decides this man's fate.
It wasn't supposed to be. This is it. This is him. Oh, I found it. Load now. Get away, you mutt! Get away, you beast! What's going on? It's Bishop. What in God's name are you doing? What do you think I'm doing? Digging turnips? The beast just went for me! Isn't that Mutt the Butcher's? And isn't that body the butcher's? Yeah, that's him. What's that got to do with anything? I'd say the poor creature is standing guard over his master. You weren't trying to get to him, were you? What do you care what I'm doing here? What are you doing here? came to bury my parents. So bury them and leave me be. Do you know what happened to Teresa from the mill? When I fled, the Cumans wanted to... They meant to violate her, and God knows what else. No, I don't know. What do I care? They probably raped her and killed her like all the others. Her misfortune. Right now, I've got to take care of myself. How did you manage to get away? How do you think? I ran. Would you lend me that spade? I have to dig a grave, and I can't find another. What's it worth to you? I see you have a fine sword. I'll gladly trade you my spade for that. How did you come by it, anyway? My father forged it for Sir Radzig. It's my duty to deliver it to him. It's not for sale. Go right ahead and dig that grave with your sword. See how that goes. And where will you dig it anyway? Here? You're not going to lay your parents in unhallowed ground, are you? Father said he wanted to be buried here, and I can't take him to St. James's. God willing, later I can find a priest to consecrate the ground. I've interrupted you robbing the dead. Is that why you're so ill-tempered? You bastard. Okay. And now that I think of it, sorry, do you want to end up like... Oh man, <laughs> he missed. If it didn't lag for a second there, I couldn't have hit first. him. God, how I wish to be gone from this place. Oh. 
Okay, so doesn't he basically just go and get them guys? Is that him? Yes. Can't you see the sword? Who are you? What do you want? Spishek? Who do you think we are? Franciscan brothers? <laughs> We're to rob you of everything you've got. Especially that fine blade that's of no use to a peasant like you anyway. Banish the thought. It is my father's sword. You mean him? I don't think he's going to be needing it. Listen here, boy. You hand over that sword. I might just let you go. If not, you're in for a family reunion you really don't want. Leave me alone. Kill him, Runt! I cut the bastard down. As you like. Could have just cost you a few teeth. Ah! sucks. Anyways. I think it's, uh... He did save my life. And back then when he was a rat, I didn't die. Well, I got the sword taken away because of him. Oh, God. Zvishek is from Skalik. He helped me escape captivity and saved my life. I promised him a reward for it. Indeed. Well, Zvishek, if you saved my son's life, I'm grateful to you. As a token of my gratitude, please accept this reward. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your generosity. And under the circumstances, we won't ask how you... I was standing there watching me the whole time. ...swine at Vranik. So you'd better get out of here quick so long to answer. before I start thinking about it. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Goodbye, my lords. Thanks, Henry. God be with you. Hey, Henry. And a good meal inside you and get those wounds tended to. You look wretched. And if you need equipment or armor... Tell Bernard, he'll give you what you need. Yes, my lord. No more, my lord. I'm your father. I swear, how I plan to tell you. I'm sorry, Ishvan, of all people, beat me to it. But now we have more urgent matters to deal with. Hmm? Later, we'll have time to talk about it. What do you say? As you wish, my lord. Father. Good. Now go to Divish as quickly as you can, son. Hmm. All right, well. Awake already? I hope you've had a good rest after all you've been through. You might need it. We've got work to do tonight, so get up and get going to Tallenberg as soon as possible. You need to rouse Sir Divish and his men for the attack. We'll meet this evening at the Stronghold and settle up with that sly bastard. If I don't set off right now to deliver the message to Sir Divish, up, there's a good chance our men will lose the battle. Night. I can't let that happen. I want every last one oh, of I'm at 100 stand. energy. We're good. Sunset.
I was like, why am I going so slow? The Pokemon can fly. Sir, I bring an urgent message from my father, from Saradzig and Hanish. <laughs> I take it you've heard. What does your father want from me? Everybody I knew? I found out who's behind all the unrest in the region, and father and Hanish have decided to put an end to it all. What? So who is responsible for all our recent troubles? You may have met him. Istvan Toth. No. I haven't met him, but Sir Radzik said he'd been here to visit before... before the raid. I don't suppose that's a coincidence. What kind of man is he? What is he after? He's in the service of King Sigismund, and he's fighting the nobility who support King Wenceslas. They've amassed quite a force at the old stronghold above Sasau, and they're planning to attack very soon. Father and Hanush have decided to move first and destroy him before he's prepared. Oh, for Christ's sake. When? And how? Tonight. They send word for you to muster your men and rendezvous with them at Vranjik. This is madness. <sighs> Maybe it is. But I fear that Radzik and Hanish are right. The sooner we cure this pestilence, the better. Gather the men and make ready. We march tonight. Leave only as many as you must to guard the castle. Very well, sir. As you command. Will you be coming with us? Yes, sir. I have some scores to settle with them. Yes. To arms.
Cosmic Club. The whole freaking army. Well, well, divish. I see you don't want to miss the show. You didn't expect me to leave all the glory to you. Never. We wouldn't yeah, have started without armor. you. What news? Did you parley with them? <laughs> we did. And what was the outcome? <laughs> Not quite what we hoped for. Radzig wanted to go parley with him in person. Fortunately, I talked him out of it. It seems that this will not be resolved without a battle. Bloody good thing, too. Finally, we'll have some proper entertainment in the countryside. Fortunately, my son here showed immense daring and made his way into the lion's den to spy on them. Tell us what you saw, lad. Nothing. I got jumped. I poisoned one freaking cooking pot and exactly. looked in one chest and the whole well, camp beat me up. let's start with how well fortified they are. The outer palisade goes right around the whole camp. On a small hill inside it, there's a half-demolished farmhouse that's ringed by another palisade. That's where I was held prisoner. And that's where Toth's based. Him and his inner circle. Can you tell us how many tents there are and how they're arranged? There might be 50, maybe three score, most of them in the right-hand side of the camp. And the men? How many men strong are they? Quite a few. At least 80. Huh. We don't number much more than that ourselves. We do outnumber them, though, even if only by a few men. And our men are well-armed and disciplined. The foe, nothing but a rabble. From what I've seen, it's best to attack from our direction. How does it look from the other sides? The east side is all rocks, so no hope of launching a major assault from there. On the other hand, that's the way I escaped. It's where they throw all their waste. The heap's already so high, it's almost to the top of the palisade. Now that is interesting. The ramparts are long. If there are as many of them as we think, they can hardly keep watch over the entire length. Attack with full force at the gates, and they won't have enough men at the rear. That's an excellent strategy. But then I'd expect no less from you. If we cause an enormous <coughs> uproar at the same time, they won't know what's hit them. Uproar? You said they have tents there? Yes, sir. Well, if I'm not mistaken, tents usually burn rather well. And we have quite a few archers. You don't do things by halves, Divish. Okay. So, so we're gonna light them on fire. Plan. Attack from the front. Robard will take ten men and, and sneak. sneak to the rear of the fortifications. There's an entry point, but you must remain hidden. I will do my best, sir. That shouldn't be too hard. They'll have other things to worry about. The rest of us will launch a frontal assault. Rain burning arrows on them and then attack. Those bastards won't know which way to turn. At that point, Robot and his Seems squad will strike from the rear. I think it's a good plan. God be with you, my friends. We'll wipe those whore sons off the face of the earth. Okay. Okay. Avengers assemble. <clears throat> Listen up now. We are about to meet the rabble that have been trying to hurt us, pillaging, killing, raping, and generally being a thorn in our side for long enough. They may be hiding behind a stockade, but they are still a pack of curs who are no match for men like you. And tonight, we are going to festoon these trees with corpses. First, we will set fire to their little hornet's nest. Then we'll keep them busy by the gate. And when we've made it nice and hot for them, Sir Robard and his men will pounce on them from the rear. And we will hack them to pieces. Have you got it? Yes, sir. Good. Now, when we reach the ramparts, the archers will cover the men climbing it and the men with the battering ram. 
Any of these fuckers foolish enough to stick his head outside the stockade is to lose it at once. Understood? Yes, sir! Glad to hear it. Now, let's do it. Forward! Hut to, hut to, hut to. To war! Open that door. Oh, 
securing. Attack the top gate. Sick. Where's that Hungarian bastard? Why isn't he here? Don't tell me no one was in command. It does rather look that way, Hanush. Henry, where's Top? You said he was here. He definitely was, sir. I've got the cuts and bruises to show for it. We have to find out where he slithered off to. Look for clues. Anything that will tell us what he's doing. Hey, what's this here? Hmm. Well. Uh-oh. Sir, this was all I could find. A letter? What does it say, Ratzig? Alongside hunting, drinking and swordplay, you might find time for a little study, old man. In the courts of Prague, every Tom, Dick and Harry can read nowadays. Yes, well, here in the countryside, we don't give a tinker's curse about such things. Huh. That's what I've got a scribe for, anyway. What does the damn thing say? It appears to be written by Toth, but it doesn't say to whom. It says, everything is going according to plan, and the castle should soon be taken. Castle? What castle? What does he need a castle for? Sir, we took this one alive. And it seems... He's not just some ordinary spear carrier. Where's that rat Toth? Where did he go? Speak, damn you! <sighs> He's thwarted you again, hasn't he? <laughs> if you play your cards right, you might come out of this in one piece. Where is your lord? He was here yesterday, wasn't he? Come now, sir. We both know where I will end up. <laughs> My lord is gone. He took most of the men and left. 
Where has he gone? What is he planning? He writes here about taking some castle. Which castle? <laughs> uh, some nearby castle. Left completely unguarded. Now I wonder where it could be. <laughs> what are you saying, you horse son? Talmberg. Did he go to Talmberg? <laughs> You'll never get him. He'll never get... We're planning on sending him to some monastery to become a monk. <laughs> I believe we have some work to do, Sir Divish, do we not? Mount up, gentlemen. We don't have any time to waste. We have to retake Tomberg. Conqueror. Greetings. We... we were ambushed. We need assistance. We have wounded many out. Open the gate. Oh, that was dumb. Lord be praised. Here! Come on! Lady Stephanie, I, I really don't think we should... My lady. Master man! Come on! Oh, My no. men are gravely wounded. Without treatment, I'm afraid they won't live to see morning. Not to worry. We'll take care of them. My lady, you have my uttermost gratitude. May God reward you for your kindness. Every Christian should help his neighbor in his hour of need. True. Especially now, when treachery and deception surround us on all sides. Get out of the way! The devil lurks in the shadows. Come on! And one fears taking a guest into his house. See, on the bright side, I stole all the weapons and armor that they had in that castle in the beginning of the game and sold it, so... Yep. 
Six score, Grosha. like a man <laughs> I don't think so I like it better right here would you rather hide behind my wife like some mangy whelp I could just as easily cut her throat I have hostages enough and strong walls to protect me bring him here Radzig What do you want, you viper? Let me think. Oh, actually, there's nothing I want from you. Except maybe to see you all die. Fire! Burn it down! the hell man Christ uh, are you all right uh, I'll live oh. Whew. but I don't think I'll be wielding a sword for a while oh we have men enough for sword wielding a good lord is harder to come by how the hell did they get Radzik? I didn't make it to the gate. He was charging against reinforcements from the castle. We have to save Sir Rab my father, somehow. And we have to save my wife and get our home back. My friend, I think you know as well as I, we have to lay siege. No. No. That is our last resort. We have to try all our other options. Sir, if... A few men could scale the western wall after dark. Maybe they could get inside, free the hostages, and open the gate. That is, if they're holding them in the courtyard, as we've always done. Well, that's a big if. What if they're seen and they can't raise the portcullis quietly? Sir Hanish, if we can save just one hostage... It's a perilous undertaking. Who would you send? I'll go.
then let us make ready. Out of the frying pan. I'd better get ready for the night raid. Some light clothing would be best. Dark colours. Oh, suck. I don't got none of that. More damage just or the greater chance of poisoning your opponent when you hit him. Each blow in an uninterrupted chain will hurt your opponent more than the previous one. An interruption will cancel the bonus. You have a 20% greater strength, agility, warfare, defense in a fight when you're outnumbered. Oh, I want that one. A full freaking day before the night raid, though. We have 7,000 Groshen right now. And over the trophies. What? I have some trophies. Show me. So many. My lad, you... Oh. I'm ready. Are you sure? Yes. I'm... Very well. I'm as ready as I'll ever be. If any of you are having second thoughts, this is your last chance to speak. Very well. So I hope we're all clear on what has to be done. We need to free the hostages to deprive Toth of his advantage. Now he'll be keeping them somewhere where they can be guarded, but somewhere separate from his other men. And where would that be? We always kept our captives in the house on the bailey by the stables. And what if they're in their tower or somewhere else? Then we'll have to go to the gate and try to open it. But that will take time and attract attention. So we can only do it if we know exactly how things stand. And if they sound the alarm, before we've done anything, we get out of there quick. Understood? And leave them there? Better a couple of hostages than a pile of corpses. Lord Capon, are you quite certain you want to engage in this action? Quite. 
After all, it can't be much different from sneaking out of the upper castle in Ratte and back in every night. <laughs> Besides, who else will keep this hothead from raising bloody mayhem? Well, see to it that you do, my lord. May God guide our footsteps. This guy's a walking tin can alarm. Why do I bother asking? Oh, well, I Be never quiet to watch that light on the battlements. Fuck this waiting, I'm gonna climb. Watch this side, but there are still two guards on the portcullis winch to deal with. Any volunteers? Henry will do it. T buffoon? Henry then. Just make sure you keep quiet. Go first and take out the sentries. Wait here. Hey. Hey. What are they waiting for? Who are you? What are they waiting for? How should I know? Why do I bother asking? Oh, be quiet to watch that light on the battlements.
there are still two guards on the Port Callus winch to deal with. Any volunteers? Henry will do it. For food? Henry, then. Just make sure you keep quiet. Christ in heaven, who are you dragging here? What did you do to him? So I sneak past the first dude and get the other guy first then? What's going on here? Time's the charm. What are they waiting for? Quiet for fuck's sake. What are they waiting for? How should I know? Why do I bother asking? Oh, be quiet and watch that light on the battlements. Fuck this waiting up in a climb. Watch this side, but there are still two guards on the Port Callus winch to deal with. Any volunteers? Henry will do it. Buffoon? Henry, then. Just make sure you keep quiet.
We'll go first and take out the sentries. Wait here. What are they waiting for? Quiet for fuck's sake. What are they waiting for? How should I know? Why do I bother asking? Oh, be quiet and watch that light on the battlements. Put on his armor and watch this side. But there are still two guards on the port callus bridge. Any volunteers? Everyone. Buffoon. Um, what? Sounded. You've got to be kidding me. I finally get the one dude and the other one gets me now? God. Might be bedtime. I might have to do this tomorrow. Ain't nobody got time for this shit. Why is he stopping? Right oh, screw this. I'm done waiting. I'm climbing. There's still two guards. Any volunteers? Henry will do it. Quiet for Buffoon. What are they waiting for? Just make sure you're quiet. How should I know? Why do I bother asking? Oh, be quiet and watch that light on the battlements. <laughs> yeah, this is so cringe. I'm about to get up there to the top of the wall and then see if I oh I can't even save an exit. That's interesting. Oh, 
wonder if I can just knock out all of my own people before they go up the ladder and then I can come up here and do this mission however I want to. I'll put on his armor and watch this side, but there are still two guys. That was that was my fault. Oh god, it hurts. Wait, did I just freeze the game? I think I broke it. That part was actually my fault though. I held out the left trigger for too long. Grabbing my mouse and be able to do something. I must have froze it. This is the time. We're gonna go up the ladder. We're gonna drink the potion. I'm gonna just tap the left trigger to knock him out. Cause I think when I try and go for the kill, I have to have a higher strength check, possibly. Or sneak check, I'm not sure. Charles the Fourth. King of Bohemia and Holy Roman Emperor had a long and successful reign. Of the empire he ruled from Prague expanded, and his subjects lived in peace and prosperity. Oops. When the Mission sucks. If I gotta watch these idiots carry this ladder up to this wall one more time. We'll go first and take out the sentries. Wait here. Waiting for quiet for fuck's sake. What are you waiting for? How should I know? Why do I bother asking? Oh, be quiet and watch that light on the battlements. Fuck this waiting, I'm gonna climb. They make me pay for this in the worst way. For Narnia. For Gondor. I'll put on his armor and watch this song. Buffoon. Buffoon. Fuck. Watch out! Yeah. Well, 
Enough, please. Oh, I kill. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. So I just have to get incredibly lucky. Waiting for Why don't you yell a little louder? For fuck's sake. What are they waiting for? How should I know? Why do I bother asking? Oh, be quiet and watch that light on the battlements. Good day, Henry. Fuck this waiting, I'm gonna climb. Yes. Eyes on the game, head in the ball. Very focused. I'll put on his armor and watch this side, but there are still two guards on the I don't think that this potion does anything for me. It gives me more strength, but I don't even think it's a strength check. I'm not this time, so this is where I, it's messed up because I can hold LT and kill him or I can tap LT and knock him out. I think knocking him out is easier because my sneak isn't very good. But I don't know one if it's a strength or a sneak check. And two, I don't know whether I have a higher chance killing him or knocking him out. But I do know is if I kill or knock out the first dude, the other guy turns around to walk the wall. Yeah, but I think it just means eliminate is in like. Like just take care of. Because watch, I'll go to kill him. Okay. Okay. See? Damn it, bro. No Jesus Christ! Two arms! Get over here! Oh, this is cringe. I was able to kill him that time, though. That first guy. 
No, and then the first couple times I went up there, it was I killed the first dude, but then the other guy turned around and he's like, hey, what are you doing? So I had to sneak past that first guy and either kill or knock out that second guy and then turn around and either kill or knock out the first guy. Well, but I now, never... when I'm successful in getting the second guy, I keep failing. I'm knocking out that first dude. We'll go first. We'll go. Take out the sentries. Wait here. <laughs> Cloud looks pissed. I don't know, but I'm going to try this like one or two more times. And if it doesn't for? work out, I got to go to sleep. I'm going to have to do this what tomorrow. Why do I bother asking? Oh, be quiet. Lightning fast punches. Yeah, I'm getting, I'm really tired. I would probably be nodding in and out if I wouldn't have come home and fell asleep sitting in this chair for the first hour. You have swords? No curva. You think I care if you have Batteries swords? Everyone. Get over here. Ouchie. 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 It's the fist fight. Hello, darkness, my old friend. I'm at this dumb ladder again. Hey! I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna freak out. I can't kill it. I can't kill it! That might have been a little loud. That's my bad. What are they waiting for? Quiet for fuck's sake. What are they waiting for? How should I know? Why do I bother asking? Oh, be quiet. Oh. What's that right on the battlements? Why is Hans leading this mission anyway? Oh, man. I'll put on his armor and 
watch this side, but there are still two guards on the fort now. What if these guys will do it? He's going to do it. Well, I never. Fuck. I hate you. I hate you. I hate you. Raise the alarm. Watch out. Raise the alarm. Somebody raise the alarm. This guy's getting beat up. Somebody raise the alarm. Where is everyone? Quick. Somebody raise the alarm. I yield. Enough. One man's beating up our whole Enough. army. Raise the alarm. I might just have to run. I might just have to abandon the night mission. You know? Uh, I don't. I just don't know how that's gonna end. Cause then if we storm the castle and they don't have, or they still have the hostages, the hostages might die. And at this point, I'm okay with that ending. I'm okay with that conclusion. Because hey. I just I just can't win against those two guards. What are they waiting for? My sneak level is not 99. Hey! Why do I bother asking? Sixteen tons, and what do you get? Another day older and deeper in debt. I'll put on his armor and watch this side, but there are still two guards on the Port Callus winch. A phone. gonna work this time I know it die <laughs> die <laughs> please let me save the game
Hans, don't fuck this up. Please. Easy now. We're almost there. Let's not fuck it up at the eleventh hour. Mind like water, heart like fire. I am Diego Sanchez. Jesus! Get a fucking move on, man! Patience! He has to move! <gasps> Any time now. I don't even know if that's his name. He's a UFC fighter. <clears throat> Say like mind like water, heart like fire, and some crazy stuff before the fight and whatnot. He got hit in the head too many times. He's a good fighter though. I want to say he fought BJ Penn. Do we go in? Sir Radzik and Lady Stephanie. Look, Lady Stephanie? She's not here. She must be held somewhere else. Where? Where is she being held? And where's Sir Radzik? I suppose the lady might be in her chamber. We don't know anything. They herded us here and told us not to move a muscle. Good luck to you. Great. Now what? Damn it all. <clears throat> we'll have to go back empty-handed. I really thought we could pull it off. We're not going anywhere. Not without my father and Lady Stephanie. And how are we meant to find them? They're not in the stables or anywhere nearby. You want to creep right inside the palace where Tots men are everywhere? Yes. You can't leave them in Toth's hands. It was hard enough getting this far. But going inside is madness. What good will it do them if we get caught? Then we mustn't get caught. Listen, Hal, I can appreciate your stubbornness, usually. But this could cost us our heads. At least we save those other people. told you I'm not leaving here without the hostages. If you're determined to be a stubborn ox, go right ahead. I suppose you might as well look for your sword while you're at it. No point leaving the job half done. Save your speeches. Are you going to help me or not? If you want to get yourself killed, you can do it alone. 
But before you go raising bloody mayhem, give us time to get out of here. Come on, then. Let's get the fuck out of here before they catch us. Gorova! Fuck my ass! Henry. I'd have to carry him out of here Henry, right now. Get me out of here. Watch out. Stop telling everyone what a <laughs> you are. <laughs> Over here. Where is everyone? Quick. This isn't very comfortable. Can't you stop hopping around with me? My arse is killing me. Run, for Christ's sake, and don't shit so much. Over here. Where is everyone? Quick. Get me out of here. <laughs> I have to admit, we didn't do too well. True. The shame of it. They drove us back before we even got anywhere. It's worse than if they'd killed us. <sighs> well, I wouldn't go that far. We had to give it a try. If we succeeded. If pigs had wings. Now, I know it troubles you, but it's not over yet. We'll rescue the hostages and hang that bastard Ishvan. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about, baby. We siege. We fight. We do war things. God, I, I might have to do the siege tomorrow. Hopefully it lets me save. It seems, Robard, that we're running out of options. We don't have enough men to scale the walls with ladders. And we can't afford to lose any more. We can only take Talmberg by a ruse or with superior numbers. Ruses have failed, and we don't have superior numbers. Then we are left with no choice but to build a trebuchet. To demolish my own walls. <sighs> Where is Master Faithor? He's waiting. We sent for him as soon as... Bring him to me. Let's not waste time. a divish. You will build me a trebuchet, Master Tobias. Uh, uh, a <laughs> trebuchet, my lord? That's not uh, entirely in my field of expertise. We have to take back Talmberg. Yes, indeed, sir, I understand and that. you but... are the best engineer we can rely on in the whole fiefdom. Oh, well, thank you, my lord, but it's, it's just that I've never built a trebuchet before. It's... This could take some time. Then you'd better get to it. Bernard will go over the plan of attack with you. Uh, I... Uh, oh. Well, Master Tobias, you have much to do in little time. I will not keep you any longer. Indeed. Of course, sir. Thank you, my lord. How are the preparations proceeding in the other camps? As well as can be expected under the circumstances. There are still many things that need doing, but I just don't have the time for them. Mm. No, you don't. Henry. More, yes, sir. I would like for you to help with the preparations in the encampments. Dudley, sir. Mm. Robard will brief you. That'll be all. Ooh. Robard will brief you. That'll be all. Game saved. Oh, unfortunate. I think this is the end of the game, if I had to guess. I could be wrong. I've been wrong before. I thought it was the end of the game like freaking 48 hours ago. How much time am I at? 70. 70.5. 70. hours.
that's crazy. I've almost played this game for a hundred hours. I took a sweet screenshot though. Wait. <laughs> Wait a second. Hey, it's not as sweet as I thought. Oh man. Not my Avengers picture. Oops. Damn it. Dang. I really messed up the... That's cringe. Alright. Anyway. I gotta go to bed. Good night. Thanks for stopping in. Um. Goodbye. So long. To you, my friends, it's over now until we meet again. Do, 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 do,